Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be going over how to install the Vivaldi browser on Linux. So we're going to be starting out by using the Arch Linux installer because that one isn't officially supported, and then we're going to move on to how to install it under Ubuntu just so we can cover two distributions. If you're using an RPM-based Linux distribution like SUSE or Fedora, the instructions are down below. And uh, sadly, if you're using a browser that doesn't support something like the AUR or has uh, RPMs or DEBs, you're going to need to download a script called deb to tar gz And what that will do is it will go through and it will extract all of the files and it will convert it into a to a tar package that you can use. But to start off, let's do the Arch Linux install. So to start off, we need to go to the AUR and we need to look for Vivaldi. Now the easiest way is to use an R helper or you can just do what I'm about to do here, which is to clone the URL. So you just right click, copy link, then you would do git clone. Now I've already got this on my system, but if I didn't, I would do it would clone the latest source file, then I would just do cd and then make pkg. That will generate a package for the stable version of the Vivaldi browser and it, what it does is it will download the RPM source package and it will generate an Arch package based on that. And this takes a bit of time but when it's done, it will have a generated package that you can use to install to the system. So the package generation is done, and if we look at the directory, we can see that we can install Vivaldi on Arch just by doing ls and copying this and doing sudo pacman u, enter your password, and uh, then you just open up the manager here and search for Vivaldi, and it is right there and I can launch it just like any other browser. Let's move on to Ubuntu though. So I am now on, uh, on Linux Mint and it's the same as Ubuntu about, you know, the, the, the inner workings of the machine and the distribution are the same, but to get it for Ubuntu based distributions, this means Linux Mint, Elementary, uh, other Linux distributions that are built based on Ubuntu, you would just go to Vivaldi browser. You can just search for it or you can check the links in the description that we got down there. And uh, sometimes it gets hard to find because they have all the weird things. But for 64-bit, which is what we are on, because if we go here, uname dash a, we can see we are on the 64-bit version of Ubuntu, the Ubuntu kernel. So we would download this and uh, just click open. And once you do that, the gdibi package installer will show up. And of course, if you don't use the gdibi package installer, you can also just open up a terminal like we cover in the article, go to downloads, ls, and uh, you would just click save, link as, save the package, and then you can just install it via and then that will do the same thing as what I'm about to do with this, except on most installations for most Ubuntu based Linux distributions, they usually have a package installer, the GDI package installer. You click the package install button, enter your password, and soon after that, everything will go through and uh, Vivaldi will be installed. When the installation finishes, you can just go to menu, go to internet, and then click Vivaldi. And uh, there you go. So um, I would love to cover the Snap and Flatpak versions of this for everybody, but sadly they do not exist. So guys, that was how to install the Vivaldi browser. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you in the next one.